Yo, what's poppin'? You done tap back in with the gangsters kitchen in the hood where the food is vegan and you will not get tired of eating. I promise. I mean, hey, you cooking with the blood. What's poppin'? So check this. We got another quick recipe. I'm showing y'all how I make my chickpea tuna bussin'. I'm telling you. So first thing first, we're going to drain our chickpeas out the can and we're going to blend them up. Some people say blitz, but yeah, we're going to blend them guys up and this is what they're going to look like. Now, what you can do is you can take that fork and you can smash them up a little more, but I ain't finna do all that. You feel me? So boom, this is what we got going on. Now we're going to take our, uh, our yellow onion and bust that on down, right? We're going to add that in a bowl. We got our parsley. We're going to chop this down. Yeah, up and down, up and down, boom. And now we got our pickles. Now, you can do, well, I like pickles, so I'm using a lot of pickles. You know, you can do the, the relish flavor kind, but I'm doing the deal. All those, I mean, the pickles, all those kind of like the same, but yeah, boom. So I got my soy-free um, vegan mayo. Right, we're gonna bust that in there, and then we're gonna do our uh, our mustard. You know, you want to be a little generous with both of them. Now we're gonna go to our seasonings. I got the garlic powder, the pep, the smoked paprika, dill weed. I got my celery salt. Now I'm doing celery salt, be only a little bit because I don't have celery. You can also add celery stalks in there. So I got my onion powder, my nutritional yeast. I'm also adding my black pepper. Of course, you gotta add that my parsley and my old base seasoning you want to be very generous with that as well you're gonna mix this on in right and boom this is what it's gonna look like that be a little like real tuna don't it hey but hey sonny <laughs> now boom i got my toppings off to the side now my last video i showed you how i made them for lawful so i'm gonna eat those on the side but i'm gonna i got that flat bread i'm gonna heat the flat bread up because with my tuna i'm gonna make like a little flat pit of a, a flat bread it's like a euro that's what I'm going to do with Euro. You know what I'm saying? So, boom, I got my collard greens soaking in um, salt, vinegar, warm water, and baking soda, you know, just to clean them. You know what I mean? Because that's going to be my, my green filling. And now I'm going to take my hummus. I'm going to put that hummus on that, on that well-warmed-up, grilled, sautéed flatbread. Um, the hummus I'm using is the jalapeno spicy one, right? And now I'm taking my collard. I did not cook the collard greens. These are raw collard greens. Um, bussing, they are soaked and clean. So I'm adding that on there and I'm taking my tuna and I'm throwing that tuna on there. I'm gonna smash that in there. You know, I had to do double a double scoop because hey, listen, this tuna right here, you're gonna wanna keep you going if you eat regular tuna, you're gonna wanna throw you gonna throw out the regular tuna and you're gonna eat this vegan tuna. I'm telling you. So I'm adding my uh my grape tomatoes and my uh my sweet onions on there, right? And I'm gonna fold it up like a real euro. Yeah, I'm going to put the little toothpick in. You finna see it right now. Look, yeah, you know, then I got the falafels on the side. I got the little toothpick in it. It's really not a toothpick. It's like a plastic fork thing that I cut off, but I had to do the, had to do what I had to do. You feel me? So, yeah, boom. So, this is how I made my tuna, my vegan tuna, chickpea tuna. I hope y'all enjoyed it. It's real quick, real easy. You know what I'm saying? Y'all go ahead and bust down the gangster's kitchen in the hood. <laughs> now, get out my kitchen.